Armin Van Buren teaches dance music at masterclass.com. That's what we'll be taking a look at today. He goes into a lot of really cool stuff in this masterclass, uh, finding melodic inspiration, building a home studio, templates and organization, working with pads and leads, creating grooves, adding grooves and bass, mixing, cleaning up the mix, arrangement, building drops, working with lyrics and vocals, tracking vocals, comping vocals, editing, mixing, goes into DJing a little bit, DJ sets. He goes into his DJ set, his radio show kind of stuff, uh, using DJ decks, all kind of really cool stuff in this class, performance tips, all kind of stuff. So let's get into this. But first, let's talk about some other classes you might be interested in. These are all are included with masterclass.com. Not, not all of these, but these ones here. Uh, Dead Mouse Electronic Music Production, Timberland Producing Beats uh, and Beat Making. Those are all included if you do get a master class membership. Um, I have some other classes that I did for monthly, like Kygo. There's a review down of, of his videos, of course, there. Um, and Andrew Wong, another complete music production course there. You could check out some songwriting tips and production tips at this website. I also have a tutorial about building or producing a song using only Logic plugins, uh, instruments and plugins. You can check that out there. And I'm also working on another producing a whole album just using samples from Splice that's coming soon. So please do subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified of new videos coming out. When those do come out, they might be out by the time you're watching this. And I'm also doing a review of Armin Hare versus Kygo Music Production Class. So that should be out soon as well. And just a bunch of other music classes that you might want to take a look at. Uh, Ryan Tedder, Lewis Bell, Charlie Puth. And with um, masterclass.com, at the time of making this video, when you get a membership, all the classes come with it. And there's a bunch of other music courses here I did as well that you could check out if you do sign up. Also, I am a paying member of masterclass.com. I did pay for my membership, but I also am an affiliate. So if you do use my link in the video description below, I'm gonna make a small commission at no additional charge to yourself. And at the time I'm making this video, there is a 30 day money back guarantee for masterclass as well. So you have nothing to lose. All right, so let's get into this uh, masterclass here. Uh, let's check it out. So in my review here, I'm gonna go over the PDF that comes with the class. There's a Logic Pro uh, project file that you can download as well and load it to Logic. We'll talk about that. We'll go through the different videos here, what the course is all about. We'll talk about, is it worth it? We'll talk about masterclass.com as a whole as well, because like I said, all the classes come together with it. If you sign up for a membership and we'll get into this and then with my final thoughts, there's actually a community here on here as well for masterclass.com members. We'll check that out, but let's get into this. And there's a timeline in the video if you want to skip ahead different parts if you want to as well. Okay, so let's take a look at the PDF. I'm gonna go over a couple things in here, what the class is all about. It kind of just complements the uh, video lessons that we're gonna take a look at in a minute. Um, each masterclass does come with its own workshop or workshop workbook PDF. This one's about 49 pages long. We're just gonna briefly go over a couple things here because this goes along, like I said, it goes along with the course and then you have assignments and stuff in here that you can do and things to take it further and different links to different places and stuff like that. And as you can see here, this is his first master class. It's the first time he shares a lot of his techniques and secrets uh, to making dance music and being a DJ. So a lot of stuff to learn in here. A little history. All right, so the master class team has created this workbook as a supplement to his class. Each chapter you'll find review of uh, the video lessons, explanations of key concepts, opportunities to learn more, and assignments to test your skills. Okay, and then there's a fundamentals guide for you to reference basic technology and equipment and then track lists and stuff like that. So we're gonna take a look at one of these chapters here because they're all kind of complement the videos. We'll take a look at the videos after we or after we look at this. So for example, video two here is finding melodic inspiration. There's like a summary of the chapter. There's sub chapters and everything about it here. And then we have uh, learn more. You could take a look at listen to the different songs he has and stuff like that. Listen to this, listen to that, listen to that, blah, blah, blah. And then assignments, you could do these. And then there's a, a community here where you can sh share your uh, personal creativity tips on the hub here, which is called, which is the community on, on masterclass.com. So for example, you know, this is just one of the assignments here. He, you, know, uh, you can just go look at it, read these and go do this stuff. Uh, building your home studio is the next one. And then there's like, uh, here's, here's a list of all the plugins that he uses with links to them. This is all the ones that he uses in the class. Um, he uses Logic Pro, by the way. 
You don't have to use Logic Pro to use this class. I, I actually do use Logic Pro myself, and we're gonna be taking a look at the, the file that he you can download that he gives as well a little bit later in this video here. But this is just jam-packed with lots of stuff. You might have some of these plugins, you may not. You don't have to have all this stuff to take this class. This is just what he uses. A lot of really cool stuff here to reference and everything. So again, another assignment after this, you know, this, this lesson here as well. All right, so let's bust into the videos here and see what's going on in the video class portion of this. All right, so this one is 33 videos. It's a massive six hours and 50 minutes. Obviously, you're not gonna wanna watch this all in one setting. I spread it out over a couple days. Um, learn how to make dance music from the platinum selling performer or producer, voted number one DJ in the world five times by DJ Magazine. All right, so a lot, a lot of stuff in here, like I said. Let's take a look, quick look at these videos. I'll give you my thoughts along the way and stuff like that. So of course we have an introduction of video. All the master classes kind of have this introduction of video. He, and he goes into finding melodic inspiration. Now he builds a whole song from scratch to, to start to, to finish within this class. So it's a pretty cool thing to watch over. It's kind of like being in the room with him and watching over the shoulder um, with his songwriting partner here and producer. Um, he talks about building your home studio. Some of the stuff you're going to want to gear, you're going to want to have and need and, and, and you know, uh, that kind of stuff. And then he talks about his templates and organization and Logic Pro. Again, you don't have to have Logic Pro for this course. Um, it's just, you know, what he uses. He also uses Ableton Live, by the way, and other DJ stuff that he gets into later. Uh, in the studio part one, M Melody. It kind of shifts gears here and you can watch him and some of his techniques for teaching you how to, for teaching how he works with the help of his producing partner. Um, this chapter is the first of eight parts showing you exactly how he creates the dance floor or dance floor hits get made. I'm just paraphrasing what it says here. <laughs> but um, so the in the studio, it kind of jumps around because he goes from in the studio part one and then there's like working with pads and leads. This is still the same. He's building the same track here Then in, in this in the studio part two pads and leads. He goes in a lot of different stuff with his with his tracks here that you're going to want to uh, absorb, if you will. And I don't know if you're a beginner, if you're not a beginner, if you're advanced. So it's kind of hard to say, you know, what you're going to get out of this. Um, if you're an absolute beginner, some of this stuff's probably going to be over your head, but it's good to watch because then you have like some, some, uh, somewhere to start with. If you're more advanced, you're going to be able to know what he's doing. Um, and if you're extremely advanced, then you'll probably just copy him, you know, verbatim or whatever. <laughs> Uh, what he's doing, not plagiarism, obviously. In the studio, part three, more leads, and he, he does the creating the groove videos here. It's two parts of that, adding groove and bass. You know, he really goes into in depth of how he creates his songs and melodic structures and stuff like that, and, and how he gets everything pumping using different plugins and sounds and synths and stuff like that. And of course, the big payoff a set of big leads to carry the breakdown of his track. Then he goes into mixing and mastering. There's two videos on that. And then cleaning up and mixing. So just like I said, we're only halfway through. So there's a lot jam packed in here, as I said. Um, mixing and arrangement, case study, be in the moment and then arranging, percussion and, percussion and arranging, uh, building the drop, reviewing the track, working with vocal, lyrics and vocals. And there's a couple tracking sessions here, tracking session, then a comping session, and then vocal session, editing and mixing the vocals. So a lot of, like, a lot, a lot of stuff going on in here. And then singles, club mixes and edits, and then approaching his DJ set, and then building a set to edits and mashups and stuff like that. He goes into all this different stuff in here. You know, these are in length, in depth videos here. And then using the decks, uh, basics, a couple of videos on about using the uh, decks that he uses for DJing and then performance tips, um, hosting a radio show, <laughs> um, starting and growing your career, and his, his early influences stuff, and then closing. So this is definitely a jam-packed masterclass here on making electronic dance music. Really, really cool stuff. And again, with a masterclass here, you do get access to all of their, their masterclasses. I did pretty much all of the, 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 the music ones already. So you got Questlove DJing, I did Alicia Keys songwriting and producing, I did St. Vincent creative and songwriting, I did a ukulele one, did Sheila E drums and percussion, I did, I did the filmmaking ones, I didn't do the violin one yet. 
um, Timberland here, pro music production, beat making. So is it worth it, all this stuff? I would say if you're just into one class, maybe not, it might not be something that you're, would be worth your investment because it is an annual membership that you have to sign up for. There is a 30 day money back guarantee though. So if you do sign up, um, there is all that. Th so you don't you get your money back or whatever. And that's at the time of making this video, they might change their, their, uh, their, their, their system or whatever, their, their memberships at any time. So I don't know at the time of making this video, that's how it works though. Um, and not only music stuff, there are so many other categories in here as well. And we're going to take a look at the logic file, as I mentioned earlier in a second here too. So other categories, arts and entertainment, writing, food, business, design and style, sports and gaming, science and tech, home and lifestyle, community and government, wellness. There's over 100 classes at the time of making this video and there's, they add new classes every month. So it's pretty cool. It's well worth it in that aspect. I just did this spray painting and abstract art one, which is really cool. I did a wilderness survival one, which was pretty cool. And so, yeah, it's a lot of really cool stuff jam packed into masterclass.com for your membership. And like I said, if you use my link in the video description below, I'm going to make a small commission at no additional charge to yourself. I am a paying member, but I also am an affiliate of them. So let's take a look at the, the community and the logic file that they give you with it, give you with, they, they give you to mess around with. So this is the community homepage. Um, and you could go in here and just, you know, check out different discussions, uh, ideas for new classes. There's live events sometimes on uh, masterclass.com as well that go along with different classes and teachers. So you can check this out. There's uh, Dead Mouse here if you're interested in that, which if you're watching this video, you probably definitely are. And every class has its own community and you can just check out all this stuff, latest classes, blah, 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 uh, blah, 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 blah. So let's go to the uh, dance music one here. If, if you're on the class itself, you can just scroll down to the bottom of the class page and hit this join the discussion. And here we are on the Armin Teaches Dance Music uh, community. And you can introduce yourself, you could post your, your assignments and stuff like that. Uh, this is where I downloaded the logic file, which we're going to show you in a second here. Um, introduce yourself, all kind of stuff going on in here. We can post your tracks and stuff for feedback and everything. You just check all this stuff out. So a lot of cool stuff going on in the community pages as well. It's just another feature of masterclass.com. So let's take a look at the logic file. So the logic file was kind of not really cool with this class because as you can see here, I don't have half the plugins that he used, so they will not load. So this was kind of a disappointment part of the class and within itself, because he obviously made this in logic, but with many different plugins that I don't own, so they're not gonna load. And not only that, these are all audio files, but they're not playing either for some reason, except I have the the reference track up here that will play. I'm not going to play it because I don't want to get a copyright strike or anything like that. But I guess it's, you know, I don't know. Look, see all these plugins didn't load. So something that's not uh, something they should work on or do. He should have just did it with all logic plugins if he was going to do with this because I mean, who has all these plugins? I mean, I guess some people do. So that was a little disappointing. I did actually did have some of the plugins like the Verhalla Room and stuff like that. But anyways, I don't know. It was kind of a letdown um, in that aspect. So that's a con of the class, I guess. But I guess you could go in here and look at the different uh, files and stuff. I don't know. You could play these files separately, but you can't really play them in the mix. It won't play for some reason. Just no sound coming out of it. I don't know why. But, so that is something that's not really cool within the class. So anyways, if you do have any comments or questions, please leave them in the section, uh, comment section below. Uh, check out all the other, check out my channel. I have lots of other tutorials and stuff like that. Like I said, a lot, I did this, I did a tutorial myself on producing a track just using logic sounds and samples and instruments. Uh, the Splice album is coming out soon i'm working on it it's a big undertaking to do a full record and videotape it and edit all the videos and then release the album so check out that subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell 
for when that comes out if it's not out already because you might be watching this video two years from now who knows anyways that is all for now and i will talk to you soon